Okay, so if you are someone who can spend 500 or 1000 bucks when you go out for a movie or eating or just chilling in general, this video is specifically for you. Well, to give more context, as a kid growing up, I always, like, you know, my family always had this one common rule that for every festive day, you wear a new piece of shirt or something. And as a kid, that was super exciting and interesting for me. And I was always looking forward to it. Although I don't do that shit anymore. But as a kid, I was super interested in it. Especially during Christmas. Like, you know, I would lose my shit. I was waiting for Christmas because I knew there were presents going to come over my way. And it's going to be awesome. Okay, so the main reason I'm addressing this topic is when I say 500 or 1000 bucks, if you are spending it, for you, it may not seem like a big amount, but if you really look at your watchman, your maid or your driver's family, for them 500 or 1000 bucks is a big, big amount. Now that I've said this, the reason I've said all of this is also because, see today is Christmas. Today is Christmas, so if you are spending 500 bucks or 1000 bucks when you're going out, you can, you know, swap one one time for your experience for getting some gifts for the watchmen or the maid or the driver's kids. Because, you know, to be very honest, I was brought up with a certain standard of living where, you know, I experienced this kind of gestures where, you know, new shit was given to me, clothes were given to me, gifts were given to me. And it was super exciting and it built a crazy rapport just in the family. And when I look at the families of my maid or my driver, I don't have a driver, driver or watchman, I can very evidently see that these kids don't get to experience what I have experienced as a kid. So, you know, I understand the state of privilege I was brought up in. And now that I'm at a certain state where, you know, I'm earning some money for myself, I just made this small rule up for myself for every festive day. I'm going to give them something. It may be a piece of clothing. It can be a chocolate. It can be anything. It need not be the most expensive thing on the world. But I am going to give them something from my end as as a normal gesture. It, it need not even be from my end. I'll just give it off to their parents and they may give it. But the end goal is for them to receive it on that festive day. Because... Because I feel every kid deserves these experiences, man. These are the small, small things which build up a build up a kid. I see that in real life every fucking day. The watchman's kids, they play with the kids from my building all the damn time. And, and today is Christmas. Today is Christmas, so I'm pretty sure every kid in my building is getting some or the other gift from their parent. So, you know, I just took up a small, small thing that, okay, I'm going to give them a piece of clothing and a few other things as a gift. So this one, uh, right now it's, I think, five. I'm going to meditate, go down and give it to his dad, give it to their dads, and they're going to give it to their kids. Uh, so yeah, man, if you can afford that 500 or 1000 bucks, which can be utilized to buy some gift or goodies for a kid, I think you should do that because... I think everyone deserves, everyone deserves certain experiences in their lives, irrespective of what situations they are in. This is where, you know, people like us who are at a certain position in life, we can come into picture, you know, I'm not in the best fucking position in life, but I'm still at better position than a lot of people. And I can do something to these lot of people with whatever I'm doing. So, you know, this is like one gesture from my end. I would like to follow through every year. I started that this year specifically. Um, I have been seeing my mom and my dad do this shit for a very long time as a kid growing up, you know, helping out other people in general. So, you know, I feel like this is something I saw and it makes so much sense. It makes so much sense that, you know, I should. It's not like I have to, well, like it's like I should. It's like a responsibility I must execute on. So this is something I'm taking up. I've done this like thrice this year. I started this just four months ago or five months ago where I started giving gifts on every festival. So if you have a watchman, if you have a driver, if you have a maid who has young, small kids, again, small kids, they can be like I bought shit for 13 year old, 14 year olds, seven year olds and 19 year olds as well. So, you know, again, age is just 
who gives a fuck about age man when when you are at a certain position in life the age really does not matter because it's the experience as long as they're getting to experience it i'm pretty sure everyone's going to enjoy it so if you have if you have a driver a maid or a watchman who has young kids or just kids in general and if you can do something for them on a festive day you've got to do it man it's going to make their day it's going to give them all the memories experiences and you can hope they may have similar memories and experiences like you did as a kid growing up small 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 happy gestures which go a long way it's going to make their day and i would like you to consider and do something about it